Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 20th of June 2024, evening time here in Bangkok. Hope you are keeping well, as fit as a fiddle. I'm not quite sure how fit fiddles actually are, but anyway, that's the idiom. Um, in the US, um, the surgeon, there is has been a request or a suggestion, I think it is, from the Surgeon General to put a health warning on social media sites. Um, to me this is rather a cop-out. Um, can it be that social media is a dangerous place? Yes. Can it be harmful? Definitely. I think so. I think we, there are definitely examples of that. Can it also be a fun place, reasonable place? Obviously, hopefully, that's why you're here on YouTube watching this video, right? You're not too afraid of it to even use it at all. Um, but the thing is that what we need is, pro I mean, and uh, this is a global thing, I'm not just talking about America, I'm talking about everywhere in the world. What we need is proper education as to how to use social media and what to look for and what to avoid in social media. Uh, because we have misinformation and disinformation purposely disseminated for the purposes of financial gain that's right people do anything to you know generate clicks and money <laughs> not me on this video not me on this channel of course i don't make any money from this channel really a few pennies here and there um, but i certainly wouldn't manufacture uh, you know um, content false content or provide disinformation to get money out of it i think that's a, a, hor a horrible thing to be doing but people do it because they've realized that they can do it what we need, what children need, is the ability to encompass critical thinking. We need, all children need to learn to understand statistics and science and the scientific method and um, understand the background of social media and what it is and what it does. Uh, all of that stuff is vital to today's lifestyle. I mean, you know, we didn't need it 50 years ago. There was no internet. It wasn't something that was necessary. We didn't need it. But now the internet is a part of everybody's life. Everybody's life. And young people even more so. Uh, they, they've grown up using this technology. So they have to be educated in what it is. What it really is. What it can be. What it can do. And what it ought not to do. And how they ought not to use it. Um, there we are. That's my two penny worth. Uh, let's get on with the game of Sudoku then instead of renting and uh, getting nowhere we shall start our Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle with the number three blocking as it does like this excuse me oh what's going on and across here like that it's not a good start I'm hitting the wrong things on my mouse I'm hitting the wrong buttons on my keyboards everything is not going to plan but never mind we'll continue on Well, I, weirdly, I have seen something less, something a bit more obscure. But anyway, I'll tell you what I've seen. I've seen 8 and 2 blocking this square. And I've seen 8 and 2 blocking this square. So that means that this square and this square must be 8 and 2. And guess what? We've got the 2 blocking there. So that's going to be the 2 and that's going to be the 8. And now these squares will be filled with 1 and 7, I think. And we've got 7 blocking over there. So there's our 7, there's our 1. Hmm. Okay interesting way to begin we have threes across uh, here like this and up there so that will give me a three there
Uh, I think 2469 I'm missing from this column. I need to recheck 2469, 2469. Yes, they are. And 2, 4, and 9 are in the same row, so that's going to be a 6. 6 across here, 6 across there, 6 up there. There's a 6. Five across this way and that way. We'll put five into that square. I think we'll take a walk through the Garden of Digits. But we'll pause to glance at the digits 2, 4, and 9, which are left for this column. And 2 and 9 are here. And so 4 must appear in that square there. And that will give us 2 and 9 in those squares there which we can't do anything about at the moment. Uh, anyway, I was about to wander around the pathway of digits, and I will try that now. Okay, so we've got two across here and two blocking. Two is in one of those three squares there. Block Two squares there, actually, I should say, blocking across there. Two up here to extend that across, please. Near. Uh, there we go. There we are. Two there. Two down here to up there there's a two two across this way two across that way there's two two up here oops and up there and across there it gives us two in that square two across this looks like is this the last one i think it I'm not sure if it's the last one or not but it's certainly one of the last yes it was the last one indeed okay i see a, immediately see a pair of three and six blocking across here so i know that three and six are in those squares there can't say which is which but i can say that these have to be seven and nine which doesn't help much but sevens then will be down there nines will be there or there and these are not seven or nine they must be one four and five so fives across here like this the one and the four not known really okay Right, I'll try again to do what I've been trying to do for a while. Twos are done. Threes. Ah, so I've got a pair of three and nine. Three and nine here, three and nine there. So blocking down, blocking down. And then I said nines are in those squares there. Did I not? I did, didn't I? Because three and six are there. So yeah, this is nine. So three and nine blocking that square. So that's a pair of three and nine. Now, what? Well, 5 and 4 block across there, so that's 4 and 5 in those squares. 4 and 5, 3 and 9. 3, 9, 4, 5. Uh, so, okay, so 4, that's good. So 4s are in those squares, so 4 blocking across there and across here. And 4 down there will give us a 4 in that square. This is 4 and 9, this is 3 this is 4 and 5, this is 3 and 9, so this is 1 and 7 in those squares there. So then 1 blocking across here and 1 blocking across here will give us a 1 in that square. And yeah, we already know that's 7 and 9 there, so nothing to do there. Now 1 blocking up here will give us 1 in that square there, and will leave us with 1s there.
Missing numbers here, five, seven, and nine. We've got seven and nine in the same row, so that's going to be a five then. Back over here, we're looking for one and four. Oh, there's one empty square up here. Let's fill it with a nine, shall we? Seven and eight block across here. That's going to put seven and eight into those squares there and leave us here with a six. Six blocking down gives us six in this square, six across here and here puts a six there and six going up to the top and across here says you're a six six across here and six up there looks like to f looks like it's going to finish the sixes it does do that in fact now one across here puts one into one of these squares blocking down and one across uh, sorry just blocking that square there I should say and that puts a one into that square there and this is going to be a four and four blocks up here so that gives us a four here and the last number there is a nine Okay, uh, one of the missing numbers here is 7, so 1 and 7 block this square, and that's going to put 1 and 7 into those squares and leave us here with an 8. And this up here will be our 7, and in fact 7 across there gets, gives us 7 there and 1 there. One more number to go there, that's an 8. I hope I haven't made any mistakes here. I hope I'm not going to find a double. This seems to be a relatively easy game to this point. I feel like I'm going to hit a double or something. I feel like I've made a mistake somewhere. It could still be it could still be tricky even, I suppose. But four blocks this square here in this column. We need a four there. This will be a one. This will be a one here. One across there. One down there. One across there, I should say. There's our digit one that's finished. One, two, and six are out of the way already. So let's see what else we need. Threes. We've got a three blocking across there. That puts three into that square. Three up here and three across there says you're a three. Three down here. I didn't need that actually. Across there and across there. Oh, maybe I did. One, two, three, six are finished. How are we doing on the fours? Can't finish them yet fives five blocking up here there's a five in that square five across here there's five five down here and across there there's a five uh, four now across here will give us four in that square four up here puts four there that's finished last number to get here is an eight eight blocking over this way gives us an eight there this will be seven seven across there. either I'm being particularly sharp this evening or this is a very easy game. I think it's likely to be the latter. Nine there. This will be uh, an eight. Uh, what do we need down here? We need a nine in this square. We need a seven in that square. Seven blocks down here. That will give us seven there. And a nine finishes the game. So, yeah. Either, as I say, either it's really easy or I'm uh, on better form than I usually am in the evening. Anyway, I'll see you around. Take care. Bye-bye.